Alright, what is up you guys? As always, welcome back to another OU battle versus actually a monotype poison team and it looks phenomenal. Like there is so much to like about this team. I mean that. Um, now what is not to like, <laughs> however, is um, the bulk that follows such a structured team. Uh, I actually lead off with Narsil. I think there's no downplay from me. Among Us is a natural switch in, it's something I'm gonna struggle against, but most mons here I can disrupt with U-turning uh, and the flip turning and the did have everything and hopefully something of that kind of sticks and works. I really want to see him lead off with something that don't enjoy Cabotop's lead so he can switch into his Among Us. And also Daniel, good luck, have fun, that's no... I did not want to see that. That is the wrong mom, buddy. Could always knock up here. Ah. <laughs> he had to see that I have nothing to stomach a spool. That's gotta be his strat. I'm actually gonna do a bit of a big boy play, but basically. There's no way he sludge bombs first turn. And if he does, you know, more power of my opponents. Let's see. Spool, 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 spool. Hey yo! Not gonna work in Mother Brain. Not gonna work in Mother Brain, yo. That's probably not the strongest lead I had, but. <laughs> I quite like it. All right, let's see. Um, that's probably my only way actually keeping Among Us away from me. Keeping the terrain. Um, he would draw Among Us, which is great. To Drapion. Uh, that Thunderbolt would have done some good work here, but I'll take it. Um, yeah, Voskult. Basically, I, I either Braver or Close Combat. Close Combat, while safe. Um, oh, it's a Bolt Gear Draper, isn't it? Hmm. Those kinds are the worst. Still low, Braver, Choice Band, let's do it. I think like Toxapex is maybe his absolute best switch in. He does decide with Roll, which works for me. Two gang. Ooh, 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 ooh. Because I was leveling here, why would I go for close combat? When I can kill a Gengar. Um, yes, I don't like residuals. Yes, that is correct. But at the same time, he doesn't either. So that was a tough switch in. I get what he was going for, and I think that is what made that play so tough. And Salassal. Now, Salassal is a beast in its own right. Gonna send in Osmoth, but basically, um, he could nasty plot here, but he can't. Like, his strongest move is Fire Blast. Toxic. Oh, yeah, that's a thing. Pizza time. That is actually a bit tough for me. So air spell does work well with me um, versus most of the matchup I'm going to be forced with fending off here. But at the same time, Grapion is such a easy switching for him, so I got a Fire Blast here. He could be a sub variant, which is something I fear. But yeah, like Drapion play makes more sense in my head. So, I, I, I got punished by that. <laughs> so, alright, let's see. Let's think about the combination he can provide. No more terrain. He can Toxic Spike, he can knock off. In theory, you know, Toxic Spike is kind of safe for him. 
I'm actually going to switch in my Bosch cult again anyway, because um, in theory, I should be able to um, pressure my opponent anyway. But knock off the. Oh, buddy! <laughs> God damn it. And this time I U turn. It feels safe, and uh, I think Toxipex is his best response to give me a lot of residual. By the way, this Drapion turns out to be uh, tough for me to be dealing with. And I have every reason to think that he has he should have the toxic spikes. Yeah, he stays in. Which I think is the right play. Um question is whether or not he decides to poison jab or whatnot. Costa is still a good switch in even if he has uh, knockoff. Cross poison. So yeah, that's a thing. So I have to assume his night slash too. Still, I should scare him out with scorching sands. Or just switch back and forth, see if he has the knockoff I've been looking for. <laughs> I really want a stealth rock. Don't get me wrong. Oh, he switches out. Two Among Us. Got him. Got him. This is... This is a tough game for my opponents. But I have to U-turn here. Oh, you son of a bitch. And I couldn't respect him more for it. Um, he's not gonna spore again, is he? I'm already status, so I think Osmath plays the better one. Spool, yes. Sorry, poisoned. Can't do it. And this time I'm sending in. I'm sending in Hyperacusis. Basically, I. He shouldn't stay in. He really shouldn't. Among Us, I think. It, or I mean, Salas was a good play. Drapion is a phenomenal play. And at this time, I gotta level with myself. Do I want to risk it? Cross poison is gonna do a good chunk of damage. I'm just waiting for a knockoff. I need a knockoff. I desire a knockoff. Can't believe I had a chance to kill him and I didn't take it. Ah, fuck it, let's do it. Toxic spikes. Yeah, he went for it. Like, that was. It was a thing to happen eventually. But. <laughs> I was waiting on those acids. So, anyway, Drapion is gone. <laughs> Finally. Um. Salasal can't break me. Scolipede. With Soul Stance could break me. And Scolipede comes in. <sighs> I gotta do it. I gotta attack what is in front of me. Soul Stance, greedy. He can also be sashed, and if so, then it's not necessarily that greedy. Oh, he had it. All right. This is not gonna be very fun now, is it? Um, oh, what else something I need to watch out for? My most ex, like ex, my most wasted Pokemon is Narsil. I oh, don't want to sack it, but at the same time, I have no response to Peridismon. 
And his goes around soul stance, he wins. No, he protects, however. So protect, probably Aqua Tail together with... Um, he could be fearing my um, my eventual Aqua Tail or Aqua Jet. But a, a real man attacks. Should have Earthquake together with Mega Horn or Cross Poison. Yeah, there we go, Cross Poison. And that's heavily resisted, however. So that was a rough, rough decision to make. Though I do get it. But a bit surprised not to see Earthquake. I think Earthquake in combination with... By the way, I don't want the Toxic Spikes up, so we'll do this. Um, I'm really leveling here, but... There was no way he was gonna get... Or come out on top there, for sure. Like, when you have Protect and Soul Stance... You need to have Earthquake and Mega Horn, or Earthquake and uh, Poison Jab, or Cross Poison. And uh, have, he, he could just have been dual stab, and then if so, you know, you. Ah, I don't know. I thought it was a tough decision to make, but I, I, I get it. But anyway, Fire Blast, you do plan on me. Oh, he has Protect. Oh, don't tell me. Is this a sub-variant of Slassel? If so, then, uh, you know, I I'm just tipping my hat here. If you substitute, then he forces me out. <laughs> buddy, buddy, you just, you made a book. You made a book. So... Rest of the move don't necessarily affect him. So... I mean, I'm impressed. In more ways than I want to... Uh, acknowledge. So he has Protect, Toxic, Disable, probably running Flamethrower. Or... He could be even nastier. And... Uh, just run... Uh, Wait, Protect and Disable basically allows him to not be defeated by my Boom Burst. That's, um... Fuck, that's a good set. That Salasal is so annoying and, uh... Mad respect to my opponent. <laughs> and he can just Protect again. Um, he withdraws, which is great. Don't be a Rocky Helmet Among Us, basically. Um... Flip turning, boom bada boom. Um, what would that be the right? You know what, Cabotabs has some nice punch behind it. I'm, I like it. So, saying hi, Paracuse. <sighs> I mean, this boom burst is plenty for any of his remaining months. At this point, I think it's very tough for him off the uh, stomach, whatever I throw at him, and this explode just breaks apart his fattest months, and I think he knows that. There is just, there is no dawn for men. Or poison types. Oh, Explode. I mean, Cabotops was the focus of this team, but fucking Explode, man. It just, it broke apart teams that never have been broken like this before. And uh, now he can just protect Disable here. And if so, I'm forced to switch out. And if he decides to just attack me and wrap up the game, then so be it. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> the thing is, you know, I appreciate it because it's actually kind of funny. Um, because all of my mods is in some capacity not able to hit this guy properly. Um, and I don't want to bring that guy in. I don't like basically get Costa to be poisoned, I guess. Um, toxic, protect, disable. Oh, no, this is this guy got all the stops. And toxic is the correct play. Ding, ding, ding. Um, <laughs> so what I'm gonna do now is um, throw him a shadow ball. 
I think his only move is either Sludge Wave or Fire Blast. Uh, but at this point, I don't think it matters. I'm just, I'm impressed, and that's all you need to be versus this. There's a protect nothing to it. By the way, I really like how Celestial kind of gets a red light when uh, when it goes for protect. But yeah, I figured out his moveset, and as, as of this point, Celestial wins because... Or it doesn't win, but I'm definitely struggling to... Um, Finally, get a hit on him. <laughs> Scorching sands, here we go. Four times affecting fucking die. <laughs> you pesky beast. Hate you. I love it. And that, you know, the thing is, like, I, I can appreciate sets like that because they are designed to throw you off, disrupt you. And he did just that. He disrupted everything I could, in theory, do. And that made it all the greater for it. Uh, with that said though, yeah, we're absolutely wrapping up with Xcloud. This has been an Xcloud week, for sure. I have a few more games to record, but as of, the, as of right now, Xcloud has definitely been doing some heavy, heavy duty. And I really want to see how insane the damage output is on this Toxapex. And yes, I know I should have give, maybe given him a kill, I know that. I feel a bit dirty if I didn't do that. <laughs> I deserve that. <laughs> so, hey! <laughs> like and subscribe. Take care, everyone. Bye.